Chapter 2, Day 4. These chapters have some length to them. Okay, we can... There's two places to turn. I need to find some sort of clue. Duct tape, used for lots of stuff. Like binding victims. Four identical boxes. They're empty. What can they be for? I've seen something like this before. Chances are it's a retinal scanner. Security measure for the boxes here. I doubt it recognized me and I don't want to set off any alarms. But I look for something that could help. What's with the random teeth? Are these remains from when someone was cremated? Doesn't make sense, they would've been burned too. Are these somebody's dentures? Ugh, I wonder if they're used. This is freaking gross. Do I really want to take this with me? What good is it? This place is weird enough as it is, so I might as well, I suppose. Man, I need to start wearing gloves. A pair of pliers right next to the dentures. Wonder what they're for. Please don't tell me it's for pulling teeth. That's totally the reason, isn't it? Ew, so gross. So we can't examine this. Let's go behind it then. This looks like it should be the machine's control panels, but it's displaying some sort of puzzle. Hmm. So I just want to test something real quick. Okay. So, two, four, seven. So yeah, the one's the important number there. One, five, six. Okay. One, four, six. So the six is in the correct place. Zero, one, six. Okay, so we know the one and the six. The question is, what's that other one? So the trick to this is realizing that there was a duplicate. A keycard came out. I should be able to access something with this. Charagma keycard is added. So I don't know if there's supposed to be a different way to solve this one. It's just... That's how I did it. <laughs> Scary-looking lion. I think it's there for aesthetic purposes. Someone wanted to show off a sense of style. Something's not right with the statue's eyes. Or rather, its red left eye really stands out. Statue of an angry-looking guy. Think of it. This statue is missing its teeth. 
here goes nothing. Okay, now it's an angry looking guy with a mean set of teeth. Look how white they are. Not that it should matter. The teeth didn't do anything though. Could they be something else? The keycard made letters appear on the statue's teeth. What could they mean? So is this supposed to be like a translation type thing? What's throwing me off is the R has two of them here. This is no good. I can't just guess randomly hope for the best. There are too many words. We're looking around for clues first. This must be the name of the person the statue depicts. Neron Kaiser, Emperor of Rome. Sounds like an important guy. So right there is another clue. If you wanted to figure out the 616, if you didn't know, converting Neron into Gematria will give you six... Oh, wait... Neron is 666. It's Nero that gives you 616. Hmm. So, real quick, let's just write this down. 5468. It's a long, long time ago. About 2,000 years of Toshio's history lessons are correct. Okay, so the trick to this one is you have to arrange them from, I think it's mo least beaten up to most beaten up, or no, most to least. So red is kind of mangled, you can see his gloves missing, his legs injured, various tears. Yellow, torn scarf, yada yada. You can see she's a little mangled. <laughs> Next worst is going to be blue. So if you notice, these two don't even have their weapon anymore next one is going to be pink. She at least has... That looks like a knife. I thought the fingers actually played a role, but it's actually how beaten up they are. And then the guy who's best off is green. Red lost two friends. Blue has zero hot dogs. Green had two pairs of chopsticks. Yellow lost one tooth. Pink had one toy poodle. So is that still there? So, red is minus two, blue is zero, green is two, yellow is minus one, pink is one. So, how do I turn? This I think we have to do last. Here we are. Fork. So I'm kind of wondering what we're going to use that for. Can't move any more teeth, this must be it. Top set reads Neron Kaiser. Doesn't ring any bells, maybe he has another significance to this place. This must be the same name of the person the name depicted. So this is how you're supposed to get it, you have to translate his name into... I guess that's a Greek? Some sort of hint. And here's the Gematria thing, where N is worth 50. R is equal to 200. I don't know why they have them listed twice. O, V equals 6. Q is 100. S is equal to 60. Oh, 
Okay, so this is the answer to the other one. Okay, so this puzzle sucks. The thing that really, really sucks is it starts off with the second beast, which makes you think, hey, that's going to be the first three, but no, that's not. They needed to choose better words for this one. These don't even line up exactly. In case you're wondering, I'm cutting out all the parts where I was trying different things, figure out, okay, this goes where, and yeah. Light turn green, what am I supposed to do now? Now I can carry the creepy looking eye around. So I think we're done with that. have that open, but now we need to do this one. increase. That'll speed up the cremation process. Need to figure out a way to open the bin. Okay. So the highest one we have here is R. R is bigger than the next highest, which is Q. Q is bigger than the next highest, which is S, which is bigger than N. which is bigger than O or V. Now unlock the bin, I just need to wait for the process to finish. The remains are in the bin, I should be able to pull it out. Looks like there's something I could do with this. Maybe I put them in the boxes over there? Look at those open bins beg me to pour something in them. Look, they have just what the doctor ordered. If I make this thing work, maybe I'll find something about what the Mad Angels are doing. It's odd there was a red light last time. Remember this thing detected is in the discarded pile. Should try again. So it still doesn't really make a lot of sense because I the solution I did, I tried before, relative to the red light and everything, and I don't know if it's only possible if the red is somewhere over here or something. It, this puzzle is so poorly explained. Okay, I have pliers combined with duct tape. Combine these together to make makeshift tongs. This is a biochip. Does this mean? I better return to AG and tell him what's up. So, yeah, this entire thing is a mess, to be perfectly honest with you. <laughs> 